Welcome back everyone, Breakfast Club CTG back in this beat. Today I'm going over why I started CrossFit. going over why I started CrossFit. I know it kind of seems contradictory. I'm inside a normal Globo gym right now, but I've had a crazy day today, and this is the only chance I've gotten to work out. It's like 7.40 right now. Unfortunately, the CrossFit gym's not open and no CrossFit classes. So I thought I'd make this video for you guys in terms of why I started CrossFit last year, 2019, how it's been going, my thoughts, almost a year into it. So this is the setting, just a normal Globo gym. I'm gonna hit a normal just shoulder workout today. Believe it or not, I haven't worked out for about two weeks. I've worked out three times this week in terms of weight training. Before that, it was two weeks without weights and my body is wrecked. So yesterday I took an active rest day and today I'm doing just a shoulder workout because everything is sore besides my shoulders and legs. So why I started CrossFit, let's get into the video. All right, so one of the biggest reasons why I decided to start CrossFit was because of the movements. I kind of got, I didn't get tired of the same old routine but I noticed that I was getting a lot tighter and I couldn't do a lot of movements like I used to. Like growing up as a kid, you're kind of athletic, you're nimble, and I kind of started feeling like I wasn't able to do that anymore. And CrossFit focuses a lot on mobility, flexibility, gymnastics, Olympic lifting. You have to be very mobile, very athletic, and very flexible, I guess, in order to do those movements. So that was the biggest reason why I wanted to start CrossFit. A lot of, a lot of people were like, oh, I want to try something new. I want to get shredded. I want to I want to challenge. I just wanted to be able to move, <laughs> to move for real life. That's basically what I wanted to do. I want to be able to lift, run, jump, throw things, that sort of thing. So the movements, mobility was the biggest selling point for me in terms of going over to CrossFit. All right, so the next biggest reason for starting CrossFit was having something to work toward in terms of new goals, new gains. Um, I made a ton of newbie gains right off the bat whenever I first started with all the movements like the overhead squats, power cleans, Olympic lifting and all that. Prior to starting CrossFit though, I did a functional bodybuilding program by Marcus Philly, which helped me out a lot in terms of like the breathing, the mobility, which brings me into the next point. The next biggest piece that got me to start to do CrossFit was the breathing point or the breathing aspect of it. So it's a lot of breathing, a lot of cardio, a lot of endurance, and I definitely needed to work on that. I, that's a piece that I was missing. I would still do cardio, but just steady state, like treadmill, inclined treadmill walking, stair stepper, which kind of elevated my heart rate a little bit, but it wasn't anything crazy, anything drastic. So the breathing and CrossFit was a big selling point for me. I wanted to be able to run. I wanted to be able to breathe. I wanted just to be overall athletic in terms of running, jumping, sprinting, lifting, being powerful and explosive, which was awesome. Um, as you saw here, there's a time and place for static movements, for isolation lifts and movements, which we still do in CrossFit. And it's basically the foundation and the fundamentals of it. But I like the more athletic, explosive, powerful aspect of it as well. And the next point of that is in everyday life, you kind of need that powerfulness, that explosiveness for when life comes at you. So I don't know, just doing chores, playing with your kids. Maybe you're in a situation where you you're in the flight or fight moment and you just need to be able to, you know, to react quickly, to be confident in yourself and to know that you can perform to whatever it may be, whether you have to lift something, where you have to jump, you really have to run super fast, scale something, run into something, tackle someone, I don't know, that sort of thing. So that was another big selling point is just the functional fitness, everyday lifestyle of CrossFit that I liked, which definitely sold me on it. The next biggest piece was the goal setting and the progressions. Everything was new and I was definitely out of my comfort zone. I was very uncomfortable. It was honestly just a big mental struggle at first in terms of being in a class setting, not really sharing my fitness with other people. When I'm in here, I'm just headphones on, go to work, which was there. It's a class environment. There's a coach telling you what to do. Loud music, you're talking to people. So it was very different, which brings me into the next point. I wanted to be part of a community. I feel like the fitness scene industry is kind of a community in itself, but it's after the fact. Whereas CrossFit is, CrossFit is during and throughout your journey. So during your workout, 
after the workout people kind of stay and gather people have like a coffee a pre-workout coffee beforehand a ton of boxes have like almost like their little own baristas in the box which is awesome or little coffee stations after the workout people go out with each other to the brewery or go get a burger competitions to other towns and stuff which i hadn't seen before and like the fitness space and industry and it really took me back to when i was a kid going to football games going to like different sporting tournaments and events and stuff which was really awesome and i really loved that and just the whole community online is awesome man everyone's in pain everyone's going hard and the fact that everyone's still rooting for each other and cheering each other on there's no one like trying to there's like no jealousy and envy and stuff which i kind of felt in the bodybuilding space it's kind of weird um, in terms of like going to like little supplement shops and like there'd be big names there and like everyone kind of be bean mugging you and it's kind of weird. I thought it was just me. I went there with a few buddies that aren't really into lifting or they kind of are, you know, they're kind of just into fitness in general and to health and they kind of felt it too. So it wasn't just me and that's what, that's why I wanted to transition over as well. Community is a big part of it. And my last biggest piece is just the lifestyle it brings. It preaches health, getting better overall in every aspect and balance. Balance is the biggest part. So being balanced in terms of your health, right? Eating, being overall healthy, being able to move, being able to push yourself in workouts, lift, to endure that pain, put yourself in the pain cave, willingly suffer with other people around you, cheer people on when they're hitting PRs. The competitiveness in terms of you want to push someone, you want them to push you, you're kind of trying to beat each other, and overall you're all getting better. And then after, you can still go out and enjoy foods that you like. Pizza and burgers, fries and pizza and, and wings, burgers and fries, being able to go have a beer if you like beers, if that's your thing. Obviously everything in moderation, everyone kind of does it together, and it's a lifestyle, it's a community, and it's just about bettering each other and everyone around you. So that is why I started CrossFit. I haven't looked back since. Obviously, this is kind of a contradicting video because I'm in the normal gym space, and like I said, I just it's been it's been a busy day today, so that's why I had to at least come and move and get a sweat in, get a workout in. So that is why I started CrossFit for online training and nutrition coaching. Hit the link in the description. I'd love to help you out for any supplements. OneUpNutrition.com. Code shots G. Link in the description. As always, don't forget to like, share, comment, subscribe. Head over to Instagram, follow me there, shots underscore G. Let me know you came from here. As always, Breakfast Club, ETG, be out to speed.